Hi friends, welcome to today's class. So today's question is, A and B together can do a piece of work in 30 days. B and C together can do it for 20 days. A starts the work and works on it for 5 days. B takes it up and works on it for 15 days. Finally, C finishes the work in 18 days. In how many days can each do the work when doing it alone? So here what is the question given? So A plus B is able to, A and B together is able to do a piece of work in 30 days. And B and C, B and C together can do the same work in 20 days. So that's the information given here. And A is working for 5 days. A is working for 5 days. And uh, then B is taking up and B is working for 15 days. And finally, B is also leaving and C is coming and C is completing the work in 18 days. So A is working for 5 days, B is working for 15 days and C is working for 18 days and at last the work is getting completed. So we have to find out if A is working alone, how much time will be taken. When B is working alone, how much time will be taken. And when C is working alone, how much time will be taken. So here we are only having how much time is taken by A and B together and how much time is taken when B and C are working together. So we know that in order to solve three variables, we need to have three equations. But here we are having only two equations. So we cannot solve these two equations and find out what is A or what is the amount of days taken by A or what is the amount of days taken by B or what is the amount of time taken by C. We cannot do like that. So we have to take another approach for these type of questions. So here is it is given A is working for 5 days, B is working for 15 days and C is working for 18 days. So can we get these expressions a plus b and b plus c can be used these two expressions in this equation in this equation one so that is the question so somehow we are able to incorporate this a plus b and b plus c in this equation one means we can easily find out a b and c and from there we will be getting our answer so this can be split and written as one can be written as so a is working for five days and b is working for 15 days so we can to the right it as a plus B is 5 days plus because A is also working for 5 days, B is also working for 5 days. So we can to the right it as A plus B is 5 days plus B is working for 10 days. B is 5 days, we have taken it here. So remaining is 10 days and C is working for 18 days. So we can combine and write it as B plus C is 10 days plus C is 8 day work. The, it will be giving the total amount of work. So let the total amount of work be equal to X. So let this be equation number 2. So equation number 1 is A is working for 5 days, B is working for 15 days and C is working for 18 days. So we are combining it so as to form A plus B and B plus C because we are having we are only given A plus B and B plus C and we cannot find out individually what is A or what is the work done by A, what is the work done by B. So we are writing A is 5 day work plus B is 15 days work. We are combining and writing it as A plus B is 5 day work plus B's 10 day work is remaining. So we will be combining it with C. So B plus C is 10 day work plus the remaining C is 8 day work will be giving X. Now we are going to use the chocolate approach. So what should be X? X is the total amount of work done. So it should be equal to the total number of chocolates and that chocolates should be equal to the LCM of 30 and 20. So we know that the LCM of 30 and 20 is equal to 60. So X is equal to 60. Now A plus B how much chocolates will be consuming consumed by A plus B in one day? We know that A plus B is finishing the work in 30 days. That means A plus B is finishing 60 chocolates in 30 days. Therefore, we will be getting A plus B or A and B together will be having 60 by 30 is equal to 2 chocolates per day. And B and C are consuming 60 chocolates in 20 days. They are completing the work in 20 days. Here the work is 60 chocolates. So they are consuming 60 chocolates in 20 days. So they will be having 3 chocolates per day. So now we are substituting this 2 chocolates per day and 3 chocolates per day in this equation. So A plus B is working for 5 days. So they are having 2 chocolates per day. So in 5 days they will be having 10 chocolates. So 5 into 2 that is 10 plus B plus C is working for 10 days. And B and C when working together for 1 day they will be consuming 3 chocolates. So when they are working for 10 days, they will be having 10 into 3 chocolates. Plus, how many chocolates C is consuming in one day, we don't know. So let it be C. We are writing C is the total number of chocolates. 
consumed by C in one day. So C into 8 is equal to 60. So we will be getting 10 plus 30 plus 8C is equal to 60. So 8C is equal to 60 minus 40 is equal to 20. Or we will be having C is equal to 5 by 2. So C will be having 5 by 2 chocolates per day. B plus C is equal to 3. B and C together are having 3 chocolates per day. And C alone is having 5 by 2. 5 by 2 means 2 and half. So C is having 2 and half chocolate per day. And B and C together are having 3 chocolates per day. So from there we will be getting B will be having half chocolate per day. And similarly here also A and B together are having 2 chocolates per day. And B is having half chocolate per day. So from there we will be getting a will be having 1 and half chocolate per day or 3 by 2 chocolate per day. So now it is a time to find out our final answer. Our final answer will be how many days will be taken when A is working alone. The total number of chocolates is 60. So and A is having 3 by 2 chocolates per day. So how many days A will be taking? A will be taking 40 days. 3 and 60 we can cancel and 2 will go to the numerator. So A will be taking 40 days and how many days B will be taking? Total number of chocolates is 60 and B is having half chocolate per day. So number of, take, number of days taken by B is equal to 60 divided by half is equal to 120 days and number of days taken by C will be given as the total number of chocolates is 60 and C is having 5 by 2 chocolates per day. So 60 divided by 5 by 2. So it will be 24 days. Thank you for watching.